Okay, I'm starting over again with this one because I had to change some stuff on it. So this is uh, part 284C3MD2, line 22F1FA19C3MD2, Rutherford Bohr model, create antimatter space elevator UFO 5G well study. Um, this is uh, the second part of MD1. Okay, so here's the alien radio signal. November 13, 2012 is when I was working on it. Today's November 22nd. My thoughts. The atom is the middle core of the UFO spaceship. Then it talks about creating a force and not gravity. Use this math equation to make your antimatter for the core to levitate in the middle of the ship and to be used with the spaceship's formulas for the space elevator ideas in the wild data from line 17 to 22. This data is part 2 of line 22 F1. FA19C3MD1, fullerene core antimatter topologies, formula UFO 5G well study. So the keywords from topologies data led to this idea. So diagrams from Wiki, that's what it looks like, and quotes from Wiki. The Rutherford Bohr model of the hydrogen atom, Z equals 1, or hydrogen-like ion, Z is greater than 1, where the negatively charged electron confined to an atomic shell encircles a small positively charged atomic nucleus or an electronic jump between orbits is accompanied by an emitted or absorbed amount of electromagnetic energy, HV. The orbits in which the electron may travel are shown as gray circles. The radius increases as N2, where N is the principal quantum number. The 3-2 transition depicted here produces the first line of the Balmer series, and for hydrogen, Z equals 1, it results in a photon of wavelength 65, 656 nm red light. Atomic levitation, Bohr model. In atomic physics, the Bohr model introduced by Niels Bohr in 1913 depicts the atom as a small, positively charged nucleus, surrounded by electrons that travel in circular orbits around the nucleus, similar in structure to the solar system, but with electrostatic forces providing attraction rather than gravity. So November 13th, uh, levitate the core formula idea based on keywords found in the research. Positive charge, nucleus, surround electrons, travel, circular orbits, around nucleus, electrostatic forces, antimatter, provide attraction, zero gravity, matter. The last several videos have formulas in them for the core. All have formulas in them for the core of the UFO spaceship and for the space elevator designs. Elliptical orbits with the same energy and quantized angular momentum from the Bohr model. So this looks like uh, a certain part of the spaceship, right? So see the ideas below. So this middle part will be the core, and then it's got the two angles like this, those triangle things right here, one here and one there. Okay, so then this you're going to flip this side over so it goes that way. I couldn't flip it. I tried to. And then I got the, the, the circle shape in the middle, which is the core. So November 13th, my thoughts. Looking at this elliptical orbit diagram, you can see the points forming a triangle-like shape. Now put two of these together with the core in the middle, and you will have the design ideas for your UFO spaceship. Thank you for watching. We'll go on to the next video.